Here comes another email that I'll answer for you. Here comes another email that I'll answer for you. Hey, Strongman, I seriously think you need to have a garage sale. I mean, think of all the things you could get with all that money. Cat, it's something I don't want to read. What sort of duh things are we talking about here, Catman? Da bomb, or uh, da boys, or even uh, da hood. Uh, I don't think I want any of those. But let me tell you a thing or two about garage sales. Do you ever get the feeling that the people just got lazy taking a trash out, so they stopped right there in a driveway and started putting price tags on things? I mean, isn't it just a little bit suspicious that there's only a one-letter difference between garage sale and garbage sale? Except, don't ever say garbage like that. That's like the only joke moms have, and they can keep it for all I care. So then there's the issue of the sort of folks that frequent garage sales. Bottom feeders. Let me tell you. First, there's the haggler. The guy who spends all day trying to talk you down from a quarter to 22 cents for some worthless piece of crap. I'll give you two thin dimes for this pantyhose doll. First off, oh, that is Aunt Gert. And secondly, she's worth way more than the quarter I'm asking for. Heck, I paid six fifty for her new, and them's $19.98. Well, maybe if she was wearing a troll outfit or a witch's hat or something. I'll let it go for 24 cents. Twenty-two and a half! You, my friend, just bought yourself an Aunt Gert. Next is the Lurker. You know, the shady night manager at Stucky's type, who shades around all day but never buys anything. And you're like, is he there just to be seen? Look at this can of peas, Helvetica. Won't you help me buy it for you? I'm finding it hard to express just how uncomfortable I am right now. I don't know why. Especially since we have this can of peas to look forward to. Look, if you're not gonna buy anything, you gotta leave. You're driving away all my best customers. Oh, I feel like I need a chemical shower after talking to that guy. Do we have an emergency eye wash station? At least he bought something, lurker. We should go back to Stucky's. And last but not least, there's Coach Z. Coach Z, may I ask why you're buying up all the great for baby items? I'd prefer that you didn't. Obviously, wasting your Saturday morning just to sell $3.19 worth of trash isn't the real reason to have a garage sale. It's to get people out of their houses so the cheat can ransack them. Hey, can you put this cow lamp back? <gasps> We're running out of room in here. You wouldn't get much for that thing anyways. It's not even a real cow. See? And then we make a killing when we sell the stuff back to them a few weeks later at an inflated price. Ooh, this is perfect. I've always wanted an answering machine. It's a great day at Marzipan. Please leave me a message. Ah, uh, see? It is perfect. It already knows your name, even. Meow. <laughs> More like pre-ow. Whoa, what am I doing in this tiny box? Let me out, tiny box! Oops, hope you got the extended warranty.